are down. Now there's no flag there, and here come the Gamecocks, and we've got a free for all. football game has deteriorated on that crucial call. What set off the fight, Daniel Stubbs, even after the whistle, threw Todd Ellis down like it was AWA wrestling. And there was no flag thrown by the referee, Terry Monk, who was standing there watching. Stubbs then pummeled by a couple of South Carolina players, and both benches emptied out. Let's see if we can hear the inadvertent whistle on the play before this snap, the one that has Jimmy Johnson so irate on the play that should have been a Miami recovered fumble. <laughs> Only whistle I heard was clearly after the hit. We have a personal foul against the offense, a dead ball, personal foul against the defense, it's still third down. Where was the offside? Well, there's no way on that anyway. That was a, should have been a penalty on Daniel Stubbs, and what they did was they called personal foul to the fight. But this certainly would not enhance Miami's image, uh, and really that they had overcome pretty much this year. Stubbs coming in there and doing that to Ellis, there's no call for that. He's aggravated. I don't blame him for, for the bad call or whatever happened with the official with the inadvertent whistle. All right, they're offsetting personal fouls for the fight, but there were flags down before the ball was snapped for offside. Right, right, and there should have been a penalty on Stubbs, clearly a penalty on Stubbs. Third and 15.